What is up guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a brand new video. So today we're gonna to be exploring that house just behind me there. We have been here before. I came here once before with Sylvia and my friend Craig. I'm here today with Craig and my new friend Drone Hub. I will link their socials down below in the description. Without taking any longer guys, let's get straight into it. check this place to see how much it has changed over the years. So far it looks pretty much the same. I was gonna say there used to be a front door here. It's all been smashed to pieces. Look. Creepy. Ooh. Got a torch? Do you want a torch? Yeah, I'll do that one. I'll go another one up. Yeah, I've got a big one in here. Give you ten pounds, Simon, if you sit in that chair. I owe myself ten pound now. JD, 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 JD. This one's even got a bit left in it. I think it's JD anyway. Oh yeah, that looks JD, JDE. That looks extremely JDE. We have come to this one just during rush hour. There's a lot of cars outside. I keep flashing my uh, light against the window. You might be able to see it. And I keep thinking that there's a, uh, a car coming towards me or somebody looking in. Yeah, it's probably not the best time to come somewhere like this. But the car's getting past. Help! Probably gonna get the police called on us guys because there's a lot of cars sitting outside. So yeah, there's like queues and queues of cars sitting down that road. And if they happen to be looking my way, they're gonna see me in here. And then they're gonna call the police on us and say, somebody's in a building, stealing, setting fires, vandalizing the place. And I knew neither of those things. Let's go check out what's going on in some of these other rooms. Oh, I got a car. A Jeep. Creepy. Let's check out what's going on through here. Those dirty blinds. I want to go check just by the car to see um, see what's going on. The police just drove past again, no, different ones with the, with the sirens on. So we're well, not doing anything wrong, like you know. What I mean, all they can do is say, "What's your name? Where are you from? What are you doing?" The hell are those things for? Random. These uh, loft crawl spaces, just, I hate them. Look at the state of that. I'm like waking up in that. Nope. Random. Yeah. This 
van hem staan. Dan. <laughs> Crunch. Um, 1855. That seems a hell of a long. 150 years. Yeah. Macclesfield. Courier. About 170 years, isn't it? Something like that. It's only last that long. To be fair, I've got a lot of papers at home from the 1930s, and they are still in pretty good condition. Taste it. See if it tastes like it. Hmm. See if it tastes old. That definitely tastes like 1800s. <laughs> <laughs> oh, plenty of dust. I think he says probably a replica. I don't know. No, that's paper though, it's old paper. Ask him if he knows. He's been in there since 1855. <laughs> <laughs> These Quavers packets from the 1800s. Oh, Jesus, how much? I thought that was a window. I was, I was thinking it would be. Random, isn't it? Got a door handle. Well, that's old, isn't it? Mm. That's probably from 1855. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's a replica. It's a random toilet seat. So, this is the bathroom. Then. Some little kid spent ages painting this in it. I know. I just trampled on it again. <laughs> Absolute scumbag today. Looks like somebody's been living in here, guys. Got a great view of the outside. Look how busy it is. And Laurie's going past. Oh, it's a colour tester. <laughs> Reckon someone's been living in here? Plenty of cigarette ends all over the floor, look. And there's all over the bed, look. Cigarette ends, cans of Budweiser, more Jack Daniels, dairy milk, Guinness. Good strong diet. This is somewhere that we wanted to come back and investigate one time. I've heard a lot of mixed things about the place. A lot of people get the story wrong. They think that there was a murder that took place here. That wasn't this house. That's actually further down the road. Someone still lives in that farm, in all honesty, but not the original family that lived there. But um, yeah, this one, this was, as far as I'm aware, no murders have ever taken place in this farm. But what this one was known for was it was used as a film location for Hollyoaks. I did all the research back in the day when I first ever came here. It's probably 45 years ago. It's changed a lot since then. Yeah, it could be worth an investigation, you know, who knows? It could be somebody connected to this house. Someone could have died in this house. You never know. The weirdest thing, when me and Sylvia last came here to, um, to investigate, we, we came one night and we realised the site had been sold because there's all the signs up outside telling you that it's going to be new new builds. And we came on the grounds, we parked up, we came on the grounds. We got up to the house, it was pitch black, but then we saw this light on inside the building. And we were wondering if they were using the building, this building, as like a, an office, you know, for the building site, what would be. But they were like emergency exit lights, like like round, big round lights, big white round lights with like them U-shaped or like an N-shaped uh, light bulb inside. That was on and this was like one o'clock in the morning, so I don't know. But I can't actually see that light. I've, I've been looking around for it. It was in a window. Can't be this one. Must be the one below us. Let's go check it out. Sun's setting. So it must be this floor. So it would have been in here, guys. This is the... No, it can't be in here either. Oh, where was that light? It's not in that upstairs. It's not in this floor. Where was it? I'm sure to God we saw it. I remember it definitely happening. It's quite a nice size house, this, to be fair, you know. You think about it, like even these rooms aren't bad sizes. I'd probably make this a bit of an office. Of course, you've got your bathroom, master bedroom, 
second master bedroom. Yeah, we'd probably have our bed on this wall, me and Sylvia. TV on the chimney breast, wardrobe, drawers. Be brilliant, plenty of room. Low ceilings as well. And then, yeah, in here, maybe this could be the, uh, this could be the what's it room where I do my editing. And the bathroom. Bathroom's not a bad size. It's not bad, it's a shame about it's all smashed up. Let's go just check downstairs, because there is a few barns that we can go check out as well, guys, before it gets too dark. I'm wondering if that's where those guys have gone now. They're not in here, so I think they're in here anyway. This room, I'm sure they should have a table in it. I'm quite certain there should be a big table here. There's definitely a chandelier which is now gone. I'm curious about that. What's it? That window. Maybe I need to look from outside. It wasn't in here. It was definitely, definitely upstairs. Look at this old auger. Under the Jack Daniels bottle. Wow. Go see where those guys have gone, because I don't think they're in here anymore. I'm just trying to be uh, another Jack Daniels. Just trying to be, um, just trying to be cautious because obviously there's a road literally there, and the bushes are all dead, so they can see us directly. Those guys have definitely gone to the barns, or oh, they're hiding from me. Or oh, they've left me here. One or the other. That's the window up there. So I'm just wondering now, can you not even get into that one? I'm so confused. We came and it was one of them two windows. So we go up the stairs. How do you get to that part of the house? That is so bizarre. I'm gonna have to go have another quick look in here, guys. I'm gonna go check it out because let's try and work this out. The stairs, where are the stairs? The stairs are here, I think. In the bathroom. So I'm gonna I'm gonna look out and see what's like outside the bathroom window. Because I think I think there's another part of this building that we can't get to. That's where the light was. That is 100 percent where the light was. Okay, so we've come in. So, it's okay, kitchen. So, yeah, I'm just gonna work this out. Let's go back to that bathroom, guys. So, this is a sort of above the front door here below me. This is the room, the bathroom. So there's blinds closed, yeah? There's an extra bit of this house that we can't get to. How the hell do you get to that bit of house? You see what I mean? By right, looking at the front, I have just... Right, check it, well, I can show you now, okay? So we've got wall, wall, yeah? There's no doors. And then obviously this side, you've got, you've got room. So if we go back down, you'll see exactly what I mean. So this is above the front door. Front door is literally here, okay? So as we make our way, back outside again. We come outside and then we've got stairs, bathroom. So how the hell do you get to them rooms there? This doesn't make any sense to me. There's a whole part of the building you can't even access. Like how? That's where we saw the light. There's no other ladders. There's no stairs or ladders or anything. How bizarre. Okay, I don't even know where those guys have gone. They've literally disappeared. Okay, there's rooms there, look. I'm gonna see if we, there's a doorway there. I'm gonna see if that leads to anything. I need to dip down there. 
There's a whole extra bit of house here. Makes no sense whatsoever. Whoa, here we go. Stairs. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, okay, guys, here we go. These are them lights I was on about. This is it. They are the lights I was on about. Here we go. This is what I was after. I'm gonna keep that light off for now. Okay, so this is a part of the building that I didn't see before. It's not much in here, but at least we've worked out what's going on. So that was the very light that was on. Saw you through that window. And we stood down there and we seen the light on. And that's the light. Okay, so me and Sylvia turned up that day and we left it because, well, we didn't know what the hell was happening with this building. There was for sale, well, sold signs everywhere. Some companies took it over. And then we're seeing lights on upstairs in the building and we're like, what the hell's going on? So, yeah. I need to find these guys now. Because I have not a clue where they are. I'm going to cut through this barn here if I can. If I can. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Woo. That's a big drop. Whew. Cow milky. Oh, look at the udders. Oh, look at the beautiful udders. They could play like a proper good game of paintball here, or airsoft. Because, like, you know, there's all these little windows you can see through. And you can be like, Hiding like this, coming around the corner, boop, 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 boop. popping somebody off. I've got a duck down in here. It's the uh, milkers. Right, I'm going to get a milker for you guys. I'm going to show you a milker. Oh god! Oh, look at that! Suckle, suckle. It's quite um, quite a disgusting thing to touch. To be fair. Ghost cow? Ghost cow? Anybody would like to see an investigation done in that house back around there? Let us know. Maybe we will. Let's get half a million likes on the video and we'll come back. I'll come back on my own, actually. For that many, I'll come back on my own. I'll come back on my own for 500 likes. 500 likes on this video. Not this one, any video. Uh, let's say, yeah, let's say this video. If I get 500 likes on this video, then I will come back into that house on my own, investigate, paranormal investigate in the middle of the night on my own. 500 likes, guys. I might even do it for 490. Look at all these gnats. See them? Maybe you can't see them. And honestly, literally don't care. Bite me all they want. So I'm glad to see gnats finally. Summer's on its way. Sick of 
sick of living in England to be fair. Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this one, don't forget to drop a like down below, subscribe if you are new, and check out my second channel, the Explore Beyond Vlogs. Hopefully I'll see you in the next one.